safety measures are being increased and what you need to know when you head to a big event. Ken. Well, Kevin, standing outside, you won't see anything change. You still have your lights, you still have your ticket booth, you still have your signs, but inside, over here, is where you'll find those changes. The marquee outside North Little Rock's Verizon Arena Friday night reads Harlem Globetrotters. Enjoy the show. But before you hear the roar after a slam dunk, you'll likely hear this. When Paris came along and then San Bernardino came along, it really said, okay, we, we need to move on this. 25 metal detectors and roughly 20 wands later, management says the Verizon Arena is now beeping its way to a safer venue. This is a deterrent. If somebody means to do harm at, at our building, they're going to know that it's not going to be easy. I think that it's probably pretty excessive. Some patrons don't agree with the new installments. This is Arkansas. We don't have a lot of problems with mass shootings. I make sure he has enough clothes on him so he won't get cold out here. Mm -hmm. And I make sure he does the buddy system, make sure that where I am is where he's at. For safety mom Pam Christian and her son Yuri. Yeah, that's my baby. The increased security is her new favorite opening act. Because people these days are not um, really doing what's right by the law, and so it protects us. And with more than half a million guests in and out of the arena per year, management and little Yuri feel confident attendees will eventually welcome the new gig. Safety is really important. Thank you for your cooperation and enjoy the show. Yeah, and if you're wondering how much all this equipment costs, it's roughly $93,000. Now, you saw and heard what you have to do when you get inside, but here's a list of some of the things you can bring with you. And you can see here some things that are not permitted anymore are fanny packs, backpacks, computer bags. We bring clear bags and small clutch purses and diaper bags if you have those infants. But for a full list, make sure you check out fox16.com if you want to make sure that your event is not missed. We're live in North Little Rock. Ken Bufa, Fox 16 News. Back to you. Yeah, and I I know since they uh, announced these releases, they've had to make some adjustments to that list, so it's a good idea to check our website. Uh, but, you know, as you know, inconvenient or not, this is the new norm, uh, unfortunately. But how are people reacting to it? What did they have to say after going through the process? Well, Kevin, reaction is kind of like these divisions here. Some people are kind of with this safety. Other people think it's not necessary like you heard. But a majority of them saying the big issue tonight was time, how much time it took to get inside. But management is telling patrons just to be patient because it'll be speedier with more practice. Yeah. All right, Ken, appreciate the update. Thanks, bud. Well, people both for and against more gun regulation gathered in Virginia Thursday night for a town hall with President